In this video we're going to see how to copy a range with formatting and without formatting. So here I have a Google Drive uh, folder and inside which I have a Google Sheet and here I have some data. <coughs> I want to copy this data over here <coughs> for which I have written a method called test1. So basically it is going to copy sheet 1 range b2 to c9 into sheet 1 range e2 to f9 so let me just go ahead execute the method as you can see here the values are copied but at the same time I have another method which says copy with formatting and this time it's going to copy along with the formatting intact so let's run that method as you can see here it copied the values along with the formatting so to make it more visual I will insert drawing copy with formatting center it okay give the background as blue color and text as white color save and close and now I'm going to insert another drawing and I'm going to make it as centralized bold background will be orange and this will be white save So now I have two buttons and I can keep it here right and maybe make it a little bigger okay yes. and let me delete these clear the data and also format these two as white and for this one I'm going to assign copy with formatting to this and copy without formatting to this okay now I'm going to say copy without formatting range of null let me check what happened we can always go to this see the error cannot read property get range of null code 10 what's going on here code 10 uh, what I can do instead is copy without formatting I can give it as test one. Okay. Right click, click on this as right click, click on this assign script test one and right click assign script test two. And now let me close this copy without formatting and copy with formatting. So I hope you learned something over here. This is basically uh, some uh, inspiration that I have taken from uh, online
online post which is over here let me show you this right um, as you can see here this this is the method that really works nicely so thanks to this user who has posted the solution just I showed the implementation over here thank you everyone for watching and have a great day